What's going on, everybody? Welcome back to another video. So we are back with some more of that Vinland Saga episode 19, last episode. I'm not going to lie to you. I am so impressed with Prince Canute because, you know, when he first got introduced, I was just kind of like, he was, he's literally like my least favorite character type in any anime. Um, if anyone that's been watching my channel for a while know the type of characters I like, I mean, look, my favorite characters are like, Kimpachi, <laughs> Vegeta, Bakugo, like those are my favorite type of characters. And so when you look at, you know, Prince Canute, who's just kind of quiet and just timid and shy and don't really want to speak, you know, I was like, eh, I'm, I was looking for, I was hoping that we were going to get some growth. And last episode, we got, I mean, we, we were slowly getting growth with him just kind of slowly talking and everything, but the loss of Ragnar and him like really understanding the concept of love that the, the priest was trying to convey and all that stuff all i'm gonna say is canute he easily has jumped up there as a more likable character for me he's definitely not my favorite but i definitely like him a lot more just based off you know just the growth he's made throughout this series so far uh but also what happened in the last episode you, you got thorkill and thorfinn fighting and again apparently thorfinn did jump off thorkill's leg um, but it was just a little bit higher than he was expecting, and I, I really don't see, I don't see him coming back from this, like, he literally was floating in the air, boy shook, he was like, oh shit, I'm a little higher than I thought I was, and fell, and was like, hit branches on the way down, I mean, sure, the snow probably cushioned his fall a little bit, but the branches didn't feel good on the way down, so, uh, I'm curious to see how the rest of this fight is gonna go, uh, if the fight's not over already, <laughs> But uh, yeah, I'm I'm ready. So uh, let's go ahead and just uh, hop right on into it. Oh, they walking over there towards him. My boy Daze. He's like, who the fuck is that? There's a big shadow coming at me. <laughs> he's like, oh, Titan. <laughs> he ain't lifting an arm. He probably broke it or some shit. Oh! My guy didn't even realize that the adrenaline was pumping so much, he didn't realize his arm was broken. Look at that. And then my guy Thor kills, like, bitch, I'll give you time. I'm chilling. Yes, hit us with that, those, that knowledge. Hey, Thor is looking like, the, like a savage, a calm savage. Oh, you know what? I, I I didn't even fucking piece that two together. Yeah. What? Wait, what? No way, Uncle Thorkell. Oh, so so he actually met Thor's. Okay. And you trying to? Ooh. I've been chilling, my guy. <laughs> I'll get out. <laughs> you know how tough this has got to be? He was already, like, you know, mourning his friend's death just to see his friend again. To only have him leave again. Hmm. <laughs> Look at them eyes. Look at them eyes. Hello? You, he, obviously, I know he's not going to do it, but I get it. I get how I'll get why Thor kills reacting the way he is. He, he don't need no sword. He don't need it. Oh, he said, bitch, I don't need no sword. Damn, he fucking knocked him out. <laughs> oh, so he did find out that Thor's was dead. Oh, I was wondering if he was ever gonna, if he knew that Thor's was dead or not. Well, now I know. Oh, I, he said how he spent his time in Iceland. I was, I was like, oh shit. I, I was gonna ask, how was his his final moments? He said, you ain't no man. You ain't no warrior. <laughs> I 
He's, he, he's channeling that, that emotion again. Chill out. <laughs> Bitch, I got ganged up on. What do you mean? <laughs> I had arrows in my body. Exactly. My boy Thorkel is an honorable man, an honorable warrior. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Prince Canute is Freya. Wow. Y'all gonna see the new Canute. He, he commanding order. Now talk y'all shit. Bitch, it did. They gonna joke about it again. <laughs> oh, okay. Back to that action. Let go. Mm. I, I don't really see him winning with one arm, though. Like, how is he gonna pull this off? Wait, what are they planning? Oh shit, young fucking Askeladd, I see you. What? What? Really? What are they planning? Like, I am like in such suspense right now. Like, what are they planning? <laughs> Are they going to use the sunlight? Oh, Askeladd is going to like blind him. I guarantee you. That's why he put the little snow. Yep. It's over. It's over. Oh, his weakness. What is his weakness? His jaw? His ear? What? Bitch, you ain't going to kill him. What the fuck you think you're doing? Whoa! Wait, what the fuck? Oh, yeah, y'all are about to disrespect Thorkel's honor. Like, he won the duel and y'all was about to kill him? Uh-oh. Canute didn't show up. Oh, yeah. Bodied. Bodied. All of them bitches. Go ahead, pan to your brother. Your bitch-ass brother that didn't even fight. Still kneeling in the snow, all shook. Oh, that bitch still alive. But that boy is done. <laughs> Okay, okay, okay. Ascend, ascend, ascend. <laughs> Bitch, he lost. Right. A man of true honor right there. I see, I see gears. Shut your ass. Mmm. Yo, my boy Canoe, he, that boy became a man in a matter of, like, minutes. I guess it took weeks and months. A lot of build-up. <laughs> exactly, he has matured a lot. Yeah, he, he saw Canute as an eyesore. He's like, bitch, why do I even have a second son? <laughs> Okay, he said, I'm going to that main camp. I'm bringing a fight to my dad's door. Hello? Uh-oh, is he about to test them? Woo, he said, most of them will cry when I put this fist in front of their face. I ain't gonna lie to you. I don't give a care how manly you think you is. You see a big-ass fist, bitch. Fuck that. <laughs> he hit you with that fucking Saitama punch. <laughs> now all the snow just... My boy didn't flinch, though. Oh. Oh. Oh, that hurts the heart right there. Yes, sir. My, I know Askeladd is happy. <laughs> I don't know why I'm laughing. It got it got a bit contagious. He's probably happy. He's like, finally, I I did I I fulfill my promise to my mom. Maybe I don't know. Oh, oh! I was not expecting him to admit that. 
What? Oh, wow. You know, he had to look away to say that. He had to. Because you know he's pissed. He's pissed. <laughs> he said, don't you copy me, bitch. <laughs> he's like, I was first. This was an episode. What the? Bro. Oh, my gosh. Okay. I was not expecting things to turn out this way. First of all, I still don't quite understand Thorkill's weakness. Like, I don't know if he just, like, has, like, a brain injury and just a... Uh, you know, a slight kick to the head it was what it did, or I don't know what that was. I mean, I'm mad my boy kind of got his eye gouged out or damaged, and he probably gonna be one eye now. That's that's fine. You know, whatever. You know, Thorfinn, you did a little bit, a bit too much damage to my boy, but I guess you did break an arm. I don't know. Regardless, I like that fight between Thorkell and Thorfinn. I like the fact that Asclad kind of gave him Thorfinn some coaching. You know, even though Thorfinn was being a little hard headed, he got the dub thanks to Asclad. Um, what else happened? Uh, Canute, man. I know in the beginning of this video, I was saying, like, again, how early on, Canute, he literally was my least favorite character. Like, like my character type. I don't really like the, the kind of soft, timid kind of characters. Like, the soft-spoken. I like characters that are, like, a bit more aggressive and things like that. And even though Canute is not necessarily still that fits that character type that I like the most, he definitely has moved up and I have so much more respect for him just because of, get, first of all, the fact that Askeladd admitted to killing Ragnar and instead of like reacting in a, in a way that you would have expected him to react and saying, oh, you did? Okay, I will take your sword. He, he just kind of just... He kind of just held it in, which who knows, it might come back to haunt him, you know, trying to, because he might, he might constantly uh, resent Asklad, I don't know, but I think that just shows a lot of growth, the fact that he's like, you know what, no, screw it, I'm not going, I'm not going to end your life, which is actually a good way, you know, like, I'm not going to give you the easy way out, uh, I want you to fucking work for me, and also, as you fight, you fight for the honor of Ragnar as well, so I respect that Canute has easily, easily, you know, became... A really likable character in this fucking this first of all the whole second half of this series has been great like the first half was great but this second half picked up and it has not stopped at all and i am loving every bit of this so now they about to take the fucking fight to to the king's doorstep and yo i know it's about to go down so i'm looking forward to it so if you guys did enjoy this video appreciate it and i will see y'all in the next one peace